Hello and welcome to another video. My name is Boxiest, and today we are going to continue the What If series. What if events had gone differently? And in this What If, we're going to change the history of Cobra Kai. What if Devin beat Tori during the All Valley Tournament in Cobra Kai Season 4? So in this timeline, the events of Cobra Kai Season 4 would still happen. Johnny and Daniel would still decide to split up. Eli would still go to Miyaido, and Eagle Fang would want to get some female students, and Devin would still join in this timeline. So Johnny would train his students for the All Valley, and the events would carry on. Miguel and Sam would still go to prom, and those events would stay the same. Miguel would still be distracted by what Johnny said, and he wouldn't be focused during the tournament. And the night of the All Valley, the three dojos would advance in their matches, Cobra Kai and Eagle Fang would fight offensively, while Miyahiro still fought defensively, and the same students would make it to the qualifying rounds. Sam would still fight Piper, and she would use a combination of Eagle Fang and Miyahiro, so Sam would beat Piper in this timeline, and it would be Tori and Devin, and they would both fight offensively. But in this timeline, the referee wouldn't take Terry Silver's bribe. It would be a close match between Tori and Devin, but in the end, Devin would actually beat Tori in this timeline, and everyone at the tournament would be surprised. Johnny would be proud of Devin for beating Tori. Sam would be surprised and happy, so Tori would be out of the tournament. Tori would walk off in defeat, and Terry Silver would confront her. Terry Silver would say that she easily could have defeated Devin, and that she squandered her moment. Terry would say that they weren't done and that she was going to regret losing. He would say that she was going to feel more pain, and that she'll never want to lose again. Kreese would see this, and he would remember how he treated Johnny after losing. Kreese wouldn't want to repeat the cycle, so he would confront Terry. He would tell him that Tori did her best. Kreese would tell Tori that he was proud of her. Terry wouldn't like this. He would be mad at Kreese. Robbie would comfort Tori, and the tournament would continue. Devin would advance in her matches, and she would make it to the finals. Eli would still fight Miguel, and Miguel would still be injured, so Eli would still fight Robbie in the finals, and Eli would still defeat Robbie in this timeline, and he would be the All Valley Champion. Since Devin was fighting Sam, Daniel and Johnny wouldn't team up in this timeline, and it would be Eagle Fang versus Miyaido. Sam would use a combination of Eagle Fang and Miyaido, and she would defeat Devin in this timeline. So Sam would be the All Valley Champion, and Miyaido would win overall. So Cobra Kai would be eliminated, Terry Silver would be mad, Johnny would be a little proud of Sam, but he would be disappointed that Eagle Fang lost. Johnny would congratulate Daniel, and they would be happy that Cobra Kai was no more. And after the All Valley, Terry Silver and Kreese would go back to the dojo, and Terry Silver would say that they lost because of Kreese, that he showed empathy with Tori and Robbie. He would say that when he runs Cobra Kai, things will be different, that he was gonna make sure that Cobra Kai never lost, but Kreese would remind him that they had to close down Cobra Kai. But Terry would say that the deal he made with Daniel and Johnny didn't apply to him. This is when the police would show up and arrest Kreese, so Terry Silver would still betray Kreese in this timeline, Robbie would still go to Johnny, and Miguel would still run away. And over the next few days, Terry Silver would make Tori suffer, and with Robbie and Chris out of Cobra Kai, Tori would decide to quit, so she would leave Cobra Kai in this timeline, and he would train his students in the Quicksilver method, he would hire new senseis to help him run Cobra Kai, Daniel and Johnny would confront Terry, and they would say a deal's a deal, but Terry would respond, and he would say that the deal was that Chris would be gone, so Terry Silver wouldn't close down Cobra Kai in this timeline. Cobra Kai and Miyaido would continue to operate, but Eagle Fang would close down because Johnny and Robbie would go to Mexico to find Miguel, and Tori not having anywhere else to go to, she would go to Miyaido. Sam would be mad seeing Tori at Miyaido, but Amanda would want to convince her to give Tori another chance. Daniel would run Miyaido all by himself, and many students would want to join Miyaido, and that is where I'm going to end this what if. Thank you guys for watching. What do you guys think would have happened if Devin beat Tori during the Yell Valley during Cobra Kai Season 4? Let me know in the comments below. All members have access to emojis that can be used in comments 
and live streams. This is mandatory. This is only something extra. If you want to support the channel even more, YouTube lets me know that the majority of you are not subscribed. So if you guys could subscribe, that would be much appreciated. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure to like this video, subscribe, and turn on post notifications. And I'll see you guys next time.